Hello, hello, it's Stumplet here. Here's an item on geometry. Try to get the area of the triangle shown. As usual, pause this video if you'd like to give this item a try. But if you're done, let us dive into the solution. Now, let's try to analyze this. We have two sides of length 17 and we have one side of length 30. So, since we have two equal sides, this triangle is isosceles. Now, template over here is telling you if you have an isosceles triangle, we always want to split it. Now, where do we split it? We split it at the vertex of the vertex angle. So in this case, this point here, we want to draw the altitude from this point to this side, uh, the point where the two congruent sides meet. Now, if I drew the altitude, it's going to look like this. So let's say the red line, the red segment is the altitude. Now, since we have an isosceles triangle over here, we know that the altitude to this side, no, this side, will be bisected since uh, we have symmetry and stuff. So we know that uh, this segment of length 30 will be split into two segments. So this part would be 15 and this part would be 15. Now what's nice about this is that, let's say this is H, we, have, we now have a right triangle. Now we have the Pythagorean theorem to tell us that 15 squared plus H squared that is equal to 17 squared. Now, since 15, H, and 17, well, we have a very famous Pythagorean triple over here, and we know that H equals 8, since we have the well-known Pythagorean triple of 8, 15, and 17. So we can conclude that H here is 8. Now, after we get that H is 8, all we have to do is substitute it back to our good old formula, area equals 1 half times the base times the height. We can use 30 here for the base, and we're using 8 for the height. So we have 1 half times 30 times 8. So all we have to do here is just multiply everything out. We get that the area is equal to 1 half times 30 times 8. And we're going to get that. Uh, we can cancel one of these, I guess. So 15 times 8, the answer is going to be 120. So the given area, so the given triangle has an area of 120. And this is the final answer. Hopefully you guys learned something new from this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.